Hello, welcome to Simply Scuba, simplysnorkel.com. In this session, we're going to look at the Chusa Adult Snorkeling Package, so let's take a close look. Snorkeling Package is enclosed in this very nice bag. Obviously, clear front, we'll mesh it at the bottom to allow draining. Shoulder strap, which is going to be lengthened and tightened as you need, and then a grab handle at the top. To access the pack itself, we've got a big U shaped zip as it opens right up to allow access to the contents. If you have a look at the mask first, full silicon design with a frameless finish, so it gives you great visibility due to the design of the frame itself. Makes it much lighter as well, much more flexible because of the frameless design. Full silicon skirt and strap, so it's very comfortable to wear. And because it is frameless, the buckles are actually fitted to the skirt itself, making it much more flexible. So much more comfort as well. Obviously that can be moved to the exact position for the user. Buckle itself, obviously flexes up and down, but it's also adjustable. So you can tighten it very easily just by putting on the excess material of the strap, just to tighten the, whole, the overall strap. If you do need to loosen it, you need to lift up this tab. That allows it, the strap to be pulled back through, locks into place as soon as you let go. Retainer on the side as well, just helps keep that excess strap to the side of the face, because he stops it flapping around. Back of the strap goes into a much wider section, gives it a more comfortable feel on the back of the head, helps grip the back of the head as well. Again on the side you've obviously got that flexible buckle and adjustment as well. Skirt itself, again, full silicon design. All edges have been rounded off to give a nice smooth finish. And you've got a second skirt on the inside which increases the surface area that actually seals against the skin of the face. It helps prevent any leaking water coming through to the mask itself. So that's the mask. We we'll look at the snorkel. Quite an advanced snorkel. A couple of different features on here. If we start at the top, we've got a wave deflector, which is this orange piece on top. Obviously, it's high visibility coloured as well. But the wave deflector helps to prevent water from actually lapping in to the snorkel itself. It deflects the water away from the main bore because you don't want it running down. So it helps to divert the water away and drop it out from the bottom here rather than down the snorkel. The snorkel itself is flexible, so it's very difficult to break. On the main bore down here, we've got a movable strap retainer. Very simple design. You can actually take this piece off if you want to, just by pushing it off. And simple strap attachment, just need to lift up the clip, put the strap through and just release it and that will snap back into place, locking the strap into position. And obviously you can move that up and down to suit the particular user. And on the bottom, you've got a purging chamber down the bottom here. It's a one-way valve, so if any water does come in, especially after you've duck dived, you've also got your water in here, you can be purged out the bottom rather than have to force it all the way up the snorkel. So that one-way valve in the bottom just allows that water to be drained out via gravity or you can force it out just by breathing. So full silicon section again, so it makes it very flexible, being positioned to the user's preference. And again, all the edges around the mouthpiece be rounded off, giving a nice smooth finish. It obviously prevents irritation on the gums. And you've got some nice large grip lugs just to prevent any fatigue from prolonged use, you, always, you can put those and that just locks on the either side of the teeth, just prevents you having to bite down to retain that in your mouth. That's the snorkel. And then the fins are a open heel design, but they can be worn barefoot or with fin socks. So nice smooth finishes again around the opening of the fin. Don't want any irritation or abrasive uh, edges on there, so it's give you a, a nice comfortable fit. Swiveling buckles, adjustable as well. So you need to pull on the excess, very much like the mask, to increase the tightness of the strap. And then just to release it, just need to lift up the buckle again, and that allows it to be pulled back through. Obviously it's the same both sides, swiveling, 
So it makes it nice and comfortable to be positioned to the exact height of your heel. Then you've got a big tab on the back of the strap, makes it much easier to pull the strap on and off the heel. Short blade fin, obviously designed for snorkeling. Ridges down the side to give the blade extra strength and then a flexible material to make it angle to the right position to get the most out of your kick. And you've got a couple of little ridges on there just to help control the flow of the water on the fin. Vent in the bottom of the foot pocket. Obviously it's to help alleviate the vacuum that's created when you try and take your foot out. Obviously air or water is allowed back into the pocket to uh, sort of counteract the vacuum effect. And on the back, as you can see the back of the fin, very similar design. But on the foot pocket, you can see you've got a couple of raised knob wheels on there. Obviously, they help to give a bit of extra grip when you're moving around the pool sides or over wet rocks. They give a bit of extra grip, prevent you falling over. So that's the Chusa Adult Marston Snorkel Set.